Hello, today I'm going to show you how to lock down a WordPress website. When I say lock down, I mean secure it. Secure it on the front end, the back end and on the server. Unfortunately, WordPress has the envious title of being the most hacked content management system on the internet today. I think it's one in four websites that are hacked are running WordPress. The reason I'm doing this video is because I see all these videos online showing people how to build a WordPress website. Mostly, or maybe one or two of them will mention about security and how to do HTTPS in the URL. But it's simply that is not enough to secure your website from the hackers. Who am I? My name is Mark Moran. I'm the CEO of Cold Black Ethical Hacking, a cyber security company in the UK. Um, if you do visit my website at the above URL, it will tell you some fascinating statistics on what will happen to, or what could happen to your business if your website went down, financial damage, the reputation damage. All these should be taken into account before you start building your website. Um, 30,000 websites are currently hacked today. I think Google is currently banning about 50,000 websites a day that have been hacked and the website owners don't even know. What does my company do? We are certified ethical hackers. That means companies pay us to try and hack into websites. We're like an early warning system. If we can hack into them, hackers can. And we will let them know how we got in and they can secure that vulnerability. You'll also see me. I have two um, degrees in computer science and a master's degree in cyber security. There's a video as well on the website showing you how hackers get in, how they work, how they monitor your website. They can monitor it for months before they actually hack it. And here's some of the companies we've worked with. Yes, these companies pay us. A, it's called Bug Bounty. If we can hack their websites, as long as we let them know how we, the path that we took, and they can secure their systems, they will pay us a bounty. If you did want to contact me over anything, you can go and catch me on my LinkedIn profile, Mark Moran 10 at the end. Sorry about the picture, that's myself and my young daughter. But my LinkedIn profile will confirm everything I've told you and the qualifications I have. So I do know what I'm talking about. Anyway, back to WordPress. Yes, unfortunately, it's had record-breaking years in 16 and the years before that. And 2017, I'm sure, will be another record-breaking year for hacked websites. You've only got to Google it, WordPress vulnerabilities, and you'll come up with many. 300,000 websites running that vulnerability. Most website owners don't even know. The plugins are the biggest problem. I'll show you why in a second. A brute force attack is because hundreds of thousands of WordPress websites are running. I can go to the login page, the username, admin. Hackers know this. This needs to be changed. I will show you how to change it. This leaves the open to a brute force attack. A brute force attack being... The computers that the hackers are using, they can try thousands of combinations of passwords every second. Their computers are that powerful. So I'm going to show you how we can safeguard against that. But yes, these are the top two. And even the themes, we're going to re remove the themes. I'm going to show you how to do that. Themes that you're not using. Because again, WordPress uploads, oh, I don't know how many types of themes. And these again, if they're not updated over the years... They become vulnerable and they won't be updated because you're not running that theme but it is still on your system hosting is another one i'm going to show you how we can secure the back end so we're safe on the hosting i have installed a fresh wordpress install here on wordpress lockdown.info so we're going to start right from the beginning inside the wordpress now i've logged in a dashboard so why is it so vulnerable because WordPress installs all these plugins, plugins that you're not even going to use. The only ones that should be here are ones that you're going to use. Same with themes. It uploads these themes and this is what becomes vulnerable over the years because you're not going to update them because you don't use them. 
and really you don't even know they're there to be honest so I'm going to show you how we can put a stop to that um, stop the brute force in cPanel which is where you install the WordPress I'm going to show you if we go to file manager I'm going to show you how we can secure the back end so it can't be hacked hackers can get it, get in this way as well and this is where plugins are you can get in this way to all the plugins if the plugins are vulnerable and themes are here as well all these should be removed if they're not being used so I'm going to show you how to lock down that end as well um, when I was on about the hosting before if you visit this website robtex.com and just put in your domain name I put mine in there wordpress lockdown.info this will show you that if you've got cheap hosting this will show you how many websites are on the same IP address as yours that's the IP address that mine is currently on and these I think there's about 10 normally there could be 50, 60, 100 depending on the cheap type of hosting you've took so basically if somebody can hack one of these websites on that server they then will get access to your website your website can be totally locked down and secure on the front end but if someone else is vulnerable on the server your website can be accessed through this so that is why I'm going to show you how we can secure the file end I'm also going to secure it with HTTPS lots of companies charge big money to install this on your website I'm going to show you how to do it for free why is it important because of that it is the future of the web Google has already said websites that are not running HTTPS will not be ranking high in their search engines it is now becoming a ranking factor because your website is not secure and that's what the, the S means that means any data is encrypted anyone sends an email on your website fills a form in pays for anything the the details they put in will be encrypted so it can't be vulnerable to a man in the middle attack which means somebody is getting the information someone has hacked your server and is receiving the information could be payment details visa details I don't know email addresses could be anything they are receiving this data before you do and that's why HTTPS is very important I'm also going to show you how we can install that for free so here I am back inside my new WordPress installation um, first thing I like to do is go to the plugins install plugins click on that and delete everything most of these that WordPress is automatically installed you will never use them so I delete everything deactivate first apply I delete them because anything any plugins that I'm going to require with the theme that I'm going to use to build this website the theme will let me know what plugins need to be installed most of these will never use them and they do become vulnerable hackers will access your website through those I'll go to add new the first plugin I do install is the word fence security it's the most down downloaded plugin for security for WordPress I think it currently runs on over a million websites install now activate great plugin stops brute force attacks on the login page uh, also blocks IP addresses from countries that are, are, are attacking websites per day um, it's all I've ever needed to be honest I do put in my emails to get alerts of what's going on it'll open up this page but when I say you get alerts it's it tells you about what what hackers have tried to do to WordPress websites and what they've blocked I actually if you go to WordFence now will be on the let in the left hand panel I go to options at the bottom and, and that's all and you'll show everything 
you'd no need to, well I've never upgraded to get premium, I find it brilliant as it is. But what I do like to take is this one here. Update word fence automatically. Take that. Save options. I did receive an email off them yesterday, a security email, which I think I'll just show you. It was this one. 18th of December, this was yesterday. The number of WordPress attacks we are monitoring per hour has exceeded anything we have seen before. Currently over 14.1 million attacks per hour and rising. That is brute force attacks on WordPress websites. If you click on the link that we put in, the emails should be able to go through and read about it. But that is just unprecedented amount of attacks that are currently going on for WordPress websites. Another reason to lock everything down before you even start building the website. 